So uh, recently, and JP doesn't know this, but recently I was coming off an injury. I had a stress fracture, so I'm all excited because there's this treadmill I can run on. But I didn't know that that would interest everybody watching until I found out that this is also really cool because you can take weight off of yourself and run so that you can actually get to a point where you can exercise. So that may or may not apply to you, but take a look at what I learned about the Alter G. What can you do when you want to exercise to improve your health? Nothing aggressive, just maybe a walk after dinner every night. But that extra weight you've gained has caused so much pain in your knees and other joints, you can't do it. Now, if you lost the weight, you could exercise more, but you can't exercise until you lose the weight. You see what I'm doing here, right? We can go around and around forever. That's where this glorious piece of technology comes in. It's the Alter G. It's a magical machine that literally lifts you up. Chris Kopp of Premier Physical Therapy explains it much better than I do. So it's a uh, treadmill that takes body weight off, has a weight on a scale inside of it, it measures you, and then you wear a neoprene short that you zip into an air bladder and it inflates and lifts you off the ground up to 80% of your body weight is taken off. So it's used for a variety of purposes. In my case, I'm recovering from an injury. I need to work my way back into walking and even running again. In the meantime, I don't want to lose all of the endurance that I've no, managed to acquire. Stand very still. It's going to inflate two times, okay? Some people who put on weight, it just slowly snowballs over time, and the heavier they get, the less active they become, and the more weight they put on, and then it just becomes too daunting to make a task to try to exercise and lose weight. Walking is painful and difficult, and their knees hurt, their ankles hurt, so they just start just not choosing not to do it. So this gives them a, a way to feel like, wow, I can actually walk again and start to really get my heart rate up and burn some calories and, and commit to an exercise program that actually feels a little bit better for them. As they start to lose weight, we can increase, you know, as we increase the speed, that also challenges their endurance, and we can put them on an incline as well, start getting some calorie burn, and if they can be consistent with that, something that they enjoy and like that feels better, they're more likely to do that over time and then start to lose some weight in addition to other things they're doing from a lifestyle standpoint. So by taking body weight off, if they weigh 200 pounds, we can take 50% of the body weight and they weigh now 100 pounds. Less resistance allows them to get a little more endurance and, and hopefully start them burning some calories and going into a weight loss program. It's kind of magical, isn't it? Science, I tell you. If you'd like to reach out to Chris Kopp at Premier or uh, learn more about the Alter G, you can certainly Google Alter G or you can go to PremierPTJax.com. Mark?